10 recommended spots opening in Tokyo in 2024. Samurai Junjiro Channel. Hi, I'm Samurai Junjiro, born and raised in Japan. We'll introduce new spots opening in Tokyo in 2024. We've selected 10 places such as hotels and amusement parks. We'll actually visit the places under construction and also give you a preview of what they'll look like before they open, so stay tuned. Now, let's get started. First up is Team Love at the Budai. The nearest station is Kamiacho Station. It takes about 10 minutes by train from Tokyo Station and about 20 minutes from Shibuya Station. The closest exit is Exit 5. When you exit the ticket gate, You see the entrance of Azabudai Hills, which houses Team Lab Azabudai right in front of you. Azabudai Hills is a spacious complex like a city and was opened on November 24, 2023. It's very spacious, so be careful not to get lost. The Team Lab is located on the basement 1 of Garden Plaza B. The Team Lab Borderless in Odaiba, Tokyo closed in August 2022 and will open at Azabudai Hills on February 9th, 2024. Tickets will be available for purchase on the official website starting from January 16th. There's a link to the website in the description box. There are artworks that are exclusive to this location, so it's worth visiting. By the way, Azabudai Hills has a lot of restaurants, so let us briefly introduce three of them. First up is Shogun Burger. It's a specialty shop for Wagyu hamburgers with 14 stores across Japan. The burger with avocado and cheese is juicy and delicious, so you should try it. Next up is Eshide Latorie du Boud. The croissants made with French fermented butter are crispy and have a pleasant aroma. The next shop is Arabica Tokyo. It's a rare shop with only two stores in Japan, one in Kyoto and this one. Please try their cafe latte made with espresso extracted from special machines. Now, let's move on to the next area. Next up is Toyosu Senkyaku Banrai. It's a commercial facility that will open on February 1st, 2024. There are plans to house an onsen facility and restaurants inside. The onsen facility will operate 24 hours and feature outdoor baths offering a panoramic view of Tokyo Bay. It will bring in hot spring water from Hakone and Yugawara every day so you can enjoy authentic onsen while in Tokyo. There are plans to house many restaurants across two floors. You can enjoy eating in a festival like atmosphere. You can enjoy various types of Japanese cuisine such as eel, sushi, tempura, and soba noodles. This place is right next to Toyosu Market. We recommend coming here to enjoy the onsen after having a meal at Toyosu Market. The nearest station is Shijomae Station. For your information, the station next to this one is Shin Toyosu Station, and right in front of it is Team Lab Planet Tokyo. Tickets may sell out due to popularity, so it's better to purchase them in advance on the official website. The next place is right in front of Aomi Station, which is located about a 9 minute, 5 stop train ride from Shin Toyosu Station. It's Immersive Fort Tokyo that will open on the site where the commercial facility Venus Fort closed in March 2022. It's an indoor amusement park that will open on March 1st, 2024. There are plans for 12 attractions where you can immerse yourself in virtual reality experiences. Also, there will be six souvenir shops and restaurants. It's an indoor theme park, so you don't have to worry about rain. The tickets start from 6,800 yen. 
At the moment, we are not sure if the attractions are in languages other than Japanese. So once we know more, we'll share the details again. By the way, right next to the place where Immersive Fort Tokyo will open, City Circuit Tokyo Bay opened in December 2023. It's the largest EV racing cart in Japan. Be sure to check it out when you visit Immersive Fort Tokyo. In the Toyosu area, there are plans for a commercial facility called Lala Terrace Harumi Flag to open in March 2024. Inside, there are plans for the largest supermarket in Tokyo and over 40 shops. Daiso, the 100 yen shop, and Matsumoto Kiyoshi, the drugstore, will open. By the way, this place used to be the site of Tokyo 2020 Olympics and Paralympics. It's a bit far, about a 17-minute walk from the nearest Kachidoki station. But if you are interested, please visit this place. Alright, let's move on to the next area. Next is the hotel. It's located at Gotanda Station. Gotanda Station is 3 stops, about 8 minutes from Shibuya Station. It's two stops, about six minutes away from Shinagawa Station, where the Shinkansen arrives and departs. The hotel will open inside the building, about a five-minute walk from Gotanda Station. It's Omo 5, Tokyo Gotanda. This is a hotel located between the 60th and 100th meters of a building, completed in December 2023. It will open on April 11, 2024. By the way, this hotel is operated by Hoshino Resorts, a company known for its popular hotels and ryokan in Japan. Inside, there are areas such as cafe, dog-friendly space, and the rooftop garden with greens. There are eight types of rooms, totaling 188 rooms. In all rooms, you can take off your shoes and spend time comfortably. There are also rooms with kitchens available, making it perfect for long-term stays. The official website is also available in English, so it's easy to understand. This hotel is in a conveniently located area for transportation, making it perfect for sightseeing. Now, let's move on to the next area. Next is Shibuya Sakura Stage. The closest exit is the east exit of Shibuya Station. It's located at the back of Shibuya Stream, where the office of Google Japan is located. This is Shibuya Sakura Stage. It's a large-scale complex, consisting of three buildings. The construction was completed on November 30, 2023, but the lower floors, where restaurants and other stores will be located, are still not open, and they are scheduled to open by July 2024. There are plans to open about 100 shops, making it a place to enjoy shopping and dining. There aren't any shops yet, but there are many photogenic spots, so please check it out. Now, let's move on to the next area. Next up is Harakado, the commercial facility. It's about a 4-minute walk from Harajuku Station. This is Harakado a 9-story above-ground and 3-story underground commercial facility planned to open around spring 2024. It will open right in front of the Jingumai intersection, where the most people pass through in Harajuku. Inside, there are plans for a food court and a public bath. We don't have detailed information about the stores yet, but once we get new information, we'll share it. Now, let's move on to the next area. Next is the Snoopy Museum. It opened in 2019, but will reopen on February 1, 2024, after renovation. The visuals of what the renovation will look like haven't been released yet, but they plan to set up a new exhibition room called the Snoopy Wonder Room, filled with many Snoopy items. It has been announced that there will be a lot more merchandise, now, tickets are available for purchase on the official website. After the reopening, it's expected to be crowded, so we recommend purchasing tickets in advance. Alright, let's move on to the next area. Next up, it's Fantasy Springs. 
It's a new area opening at Tokyo Disney Sea on June 6, 2024. It will be the eighth area to open at Tokyo Disney Sea and the largest one. It will be themed around three movies Frozen, Tangled, and Peter Pan. Tokyo Disney Sea Fantasy Spring Hotel will also open within the park. Some of the hotel rooms offer panoramic views of the Fantasy Springs area. Inside the hotel, there are plans to open a buffet restaurant decorated with paintings based on Snow White, Tangled, and Sleeping Beauty. At the opening, entry into this area will require, in addition to Tokyo Disney Sea Park tickets, either a free standby pass or a paid Disney Premier Access. If you don't have either one, you won't be able to enter, so please keep in mind. There's a link to the official website in the description box, so please check it out. Now, let's move on to the next area. The last place is Shibuya Akshi. It's currently under construction behind Shibuya Hikarie and will be completed by the end of May 2024. The opening date hasn't been decided, but according to current information, it seems to be around September 2024. Shibuya Akshi will be a 4-story underground and 23-story above-ground building featuring commercial facilities on the 1st to 4th floors and offices from 5th to the 23rd floors. The planned walkway connecting to Shibuya Hikarie will make it easily accessible from Shibuya Station. The atrium on the first and second floors are green and have an atmosphere like a park. Shibuya will become an even more convenient and attractive city. The shops that will open there have not been decided yet, but once we have more details, we'll share them in our video. We share the latest information about Japan, so please subscribe to our channel. Well, that's it for today. See you in the next video.